the vulture made his biggest killing ever by preying on this third world nation, Detroit, and chewing on this, the corpse of the auto industry when it collapsed in 2009. 10 years earlier, to save money, General Motors had spun off its famous car parts company, Delco, and turned Delco into a separate company called Delphi. As part of a plan to bail out the auto industry, the government agreed to help GM buy back Delphi and save Delco's 25,000 happy dancing union workers. What GM and the government didn't know was that the vulture and his partner had secretly scooped up ownership of Delphi. And the vulture pack told GM and the president of the United States that unless Obama gave the vultures $12.9 billion, and now they would close down Delphi and cut off GM's parts. Ouch. Without those parts, the entire auto industry would shut down forever and over a million jobs would vanish. The US car czar called the vulture's demand extortion. But the US Treasury paid the 12 billion. The vultures had bought Delphi for just 67 cents a share. With the bailout loot, the shares zoomed to $22. Singer slice, 1,284,514,000 dollars. Singer fired every single one of the union workers and Delphi moved 100,000 jobs overseas, mostly to China. 